So Kelly, you're our space expert. Your husband works in aerospace. <laughs> and oh my goodness, I actually forgot about Mars until yesterday. What? <laughs> well, we talked about Mars during the day and then I was doing a lot of things like I was editing videos and all kinds of stuff. And then you and I were on text and you're like, I can't deal with right, you right now. We're, the Martian landing's happening. And I was like, holy crap, the Martian landing's happening. So um, you are our lead Mars correspondent. What happened yesterday? I, I do not want to be called the uh, space expert because that was just not going to work well in my household. I know enough to be dangerous. I called you so a correspondent. <laughs> Correspondents are certainly no, not experts. No, you, you said space expert when you, oh. inter when you first. So I just want to be clear. I got a bunch of uh, family that is that are literally our space experts, and I they 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 chide me when I don't say the things right. So you're the associate space expert. <laughs> I know maybe a little bit more the space expert. <laughs> I know a little bit more than you. Of course, this is the video that's going you know viral, and the moment when uh, NASA control gets confirmation that the rover had landed. Touch on confirmed. Perseverance safely on the surface of Mars. Begin seeking the sands of past life. At this point, the descent stage has flown away to a safe distance. Perseverance is continuing to transmit direct through Mars upon the orbiter to Earth. So cool. I love all the fist bumping and everything going on. Yeah, it was um, a, be remarkable. We were we were a little bit we got emotional, right? Because there was that moment of like, when when are they going to get confirmation? And then it took a, another couple of minutes to get the first photograph. Which um, let, let's just like be clear here: there is a rover on Mars, and just a few minutes later, we get a photograph. Like, it's wild. It's two hundred ninety four million miles away, and that's what we get. Like, it's just incredible. And so afterwards, I was kind of like flipping through the different channels and, and they had a bunch of commentators on and really what it's about. So they've landed in this crater where they believe that there's some sort of ancient river that's like millions of years old, where they believe they're going to find some form of life that existed on Mars. So it's not necessarily finding like life on Mars today, but learning of what this could have lived on this planet and how it could have lived and what it looks like. And was Mars always looking the way it, the, as far as climate, uh, the way it had been, it's going to be kind of incredible. And this one um, commentator compared it to like, had dinosaurs gone to Mars, maybe they wouldn't be extinct. What? So the whole idea is to kind of learn if there's anything we can learn from a, a civilization, just like we learn about dinosaurs and what could have happened to the to the Earth, why they became extinct, could we learn something with what the, could be the future of Earth on Mars? Hang on, you're, where do I click for more information? You're I that no, right that that's about all I've got. But I was but, just like, if you think about it, right? Like the whole idea is to kind of evolve and and learn more about, um, you know, is. It, could this, I mean, if there was a river on Mars, we have lots of rivers here on planet Earth. Is there something we can learn from that? So this is not like a go find Martians mission. This is like a read the spoiler on the story mission to figure out what happened there because we, then, then it won't happen here. I mean, well, those, are, those are your words, but yes, you could. I mean, that go is on Aaron Sorkin, T Quentin Tarantino ish. Hang on a second. So, <laughs> Wow. Okay, so they would go and then like research the ancient area that is now dried up and all Martian and like not great to live on to find if there is a wow. Right. And what does that living thing look like? Like it's like an archaeological dig when you find like dinosaur bones and like piece that together, except you have a rover that's doing that. That little rover's got a big job ahead of it. <laughs> I know. No I know. Pressure. I, no pressure, Perseverance. No pressure. Well, it's it's a good thing that the the Perseverance, the rover, has a Twitter account. My goodness, Kelly. I am so <laughs> in love with the Perseverance's Twitter account. So first of all, when you read the Perseverance's Twitter account, I want you to hear it in the voice of like Wally, because <laughs> that's how it sounds to me. But like, I, I guess it's a he or is it a she? Or I, I, it, I, I'm not sure what the rover's pronouns are, but... It says, um, NASA Mars rover launch, hobbies include photography, collecting rocks, off-roading. <laughs> I just like, <laughs> they've got such a, a sense of humor to it. And the, the tweets are great. So, of course, um, showing off all of the times and places that went red yesterday, like LA and San Francisco. But then, like, 
posting their fun videos about the landing. This video we just showed um, shows them like when it happened. But I need to flag for you though, Kelly. As I was watching it yesterday, I'm like seeing these images, right? Of like the parachute and like all the things. And then I saw the first image from the ship and I was like, how come that's in black and white? And then I realized it was probably a computer rendering that we were watching. Like, how would we have been able oh, to see yeah. a video <laughs> of yes, yes. the rover if the rover was the first thing on, on the ground? And it wasn't like a Kardashian show where, like, there's a cameraman waiting inside no. for him to walk in the door. So just I am sure I'm not the only person who thought that. But now that I've said that, you don't have to look like an idiot in front of everybody. <laughs> <laughs> um, realizing that NASA's got some good video production people. Uh, but they will have video. Um, yeah. th I believe at the press conference they said that video, they're going to have another presser either this weekend or on Monday, that they'll have like the first video from this little rover. Oh my gosh. So does that mean that Perseverance will be on TikTok? That's all I'm wondering. <laughs> I don't know. I think the government agencies have an issue. U.S. government agencies oh. have an issue of getting on TikTok because the whole right. China thing. So there'll be more of an Instagram Reels kind of account. <laughs> yeah. <laughs>